Excellent, Jesus. Excellent. You why how we came from a city. Oh, excellent in all the earth. Oh, excellent, Jesus. Excellent in all the earth.
Not far to go now. Yeah. <laughs> you want you take a photo of me, please? Okay, okay. 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 okay.
Wow. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Yeah, me not the beach, but that's the beach. Where's the beach?
Good afternoon again.
to um, listen to me carefully, and I will be asking Grafton quite a number of questions. And you will not respond. Oh, sorry, you will respond when I say, do you so declare? That's okay? Okay, beautiful. Let me ask the best man and maid of honor just to take a seat and leave them alone now. Okay. Before God and these relatives and friends, will you, Grafton William, take this woman, Eloise Campbell, to be your lawful, legal, wedded wife? Will you love and respect her? Will you be honest with her always? Will you be to her the kind of husband you know you ought to be kind, strong, tender, and loving? Whether you have much or little, whether you can live in a mansion or in a tiny apartment, will you recognize Grafton that you found in this woman Eloise a real jewel, a price? of great value, realizing that she's a very delicate individual with a tender nature. Will you understand that she like a dainty flower, like a rose in the earliest breeze of the morning? With the right atmosphere, will exude the loveliness and grace? And will you, my dear brother Grafton, make whatever adjustments that are necessary so that you can genuinely share your life with her? Will you treat her with respect and dignity? Will you give her courage and support when it be in times of sickness or in times of health? And will you promise Grafton in the presence of all these relatives, friends, loved ones, and supporters of yours and Almighty God to continue this kind of relationship with Eloise Campbell until your heart stops its breathing, do you so declare? Say that. Beautiful. The folks, the folks in here, you so. Do you so declare? I do. All right. Beautiful. Listen to me now, Elo. Eloise Campbell. Before God and these relatives and friends of yours, will you take this man, Grafton William, to be your lawful wedded husband? Will you love and respect him? Will you be honest with him always? Will you with love and kindness and tenderness and sweetness be a true help meet for him? Will he provide a refuge, a refuge and a haven of love which will give him courage and strength? Will you, by God's grace, maintain the sweet personality that you've just displayed? Always having a smile on your face as a consistent greeting card. Regardless of the circumstances that may come your way, whether times are prosperous or difficult, whether he has much in his pocket or little in his pocket, whether in times of laughter or in times of physical adversity, whether in times of health or in times of weakening. And will you promise, Eloise, to continue this kind of relationship with this man, Grafton Williams, until your heart stops its breathing? Do you so declare? I do. Beautiful. Beloved friends, you have heard the declaration of Grafton Williams and Eloise Campbell, expressing in the presence of Almighty God and in your presence that they have decided to live with each other irrespective of the circumstances or challenges that may come their way. I, as a minister of the gospel, and by the authority of the laws of St. Vincent and Grenadines that has been invested upon me as a civil status officer, I take this privilege and this opportunity to declare to you today, and in the presence of Almighty God, that they are now husband and wife. What God has joined together, let the one
I ask you kindly to bow your head and close your eyes as we go into the prayer. Minded 
person. And because she has God at the forefront in her life, I know that God is going to see her through whatever mishap may happen to come her way in the future. And with that in the word this afternoon, I would just like all of you to raise your glasses in a toast to Eloise, the number one bride of the year. <laughs> Okay, that's what give up now. Come too far from where you started from. Nobody told you the road will be easy, and I don't believe. You brought me this far to leave me. Never said there won't be trials. Never said I won't fall. Never said that everything will go the way you want them to go. The way your back is against the wall. And you feel like hope is gone. You just lift your hands up to the sky and say, help me to be strong. You just can't give up now. Come too far from where you started from.